All right. He's always been around horses. I've had him ever since he was a two-year-old, and now he's 15. Lester Courtney has always loved to load up and head to the great outdoors. He and his wife, Carol, have spent a lot of time with their horses. Not for recreation, but for work. The Courtneys are loggers, part of a small group. All that remains of what used to be the foundation of the forestry industry. Once the trees are down and trimmed, Dan and Maddie come in. Lester Courtney is always logged with horses, mules, or oxen. Lester believes the machines don't do it better. Well, we don't tear up the ground like, like cats and skidders. We go in and within six months, you won't even know we were there because it's all grown back again. And you don't have them big wide roads. Makes it, the forest look better. The average horse weighs less than 2,000 pounds, while a piece of heavy equipment can weigh up to 10,000. Because logging with animals is considered environmentally friendly, it stayed alive despite technology. Damn! It's just a lot of fun. I grew up around it, doing it all my life. Lester has never been able to trade in his horses for something powered by diesel fuel. When you got something you like, you just keep doing it. It's quiet. You don't, don't have all the noise. Whoa. You're out in the air. You don't have to smell that diesel smoke. That's the best part. Health problems, advancing age, and poor lumber prices forced Lester Courtney to a reluctant retirement in 2001, pushing more than a century of family tradition to a close. But he hopes the craft itself will stay alive, not in the history books, but alive out here in the woods the way it used to be.